In this lesson, I will show you how to apply gradient onto a text layer. Because by default, in Adobe Illustrator, we cannot apply gradient onto a text layer. So if I select the gradient, you can see that nothing will happen. There are two methods to achieve this. The first method is to use clipping mask. So I will create a gradient shape like this, and I will send it to the back, and I will use this A as my clipping mask. So I'll adjust this size here to fit it nicely, and then select both the layer, press Ctrl or Command 7 to apply the mask. Another quicker method to apply gradient onto our text layer, we can do that by converting our text layer into outline. So select the text layer, go to Type, and we can create outlines for this text. But take note, once you have created outline for a text layer, you cannot change or modify the text anymore because it is now a path. And now after you have created the outlines, we can simply select the gradient to apply our gradient onto our text. Now here's another scenario. Let's say I have this three alphabet like this, and I'll create outlines. And when I apply a gradient, you can see that each one of this alphabet has its own individual gradient. So what if I want to have one gradient which flow nicely across three alphabets? So to do that, we have to use compound path. First, let's ungroup our layer. Select all three shapes again. Go to object, go to compound path and make compound path. So instantly you will see that all three shapes are now considered as a single object and the gradient will flow nicely from one text to the other text. 